Californian state officials are studying ways to withhold the state's payment of federal tax dollars to Washington in order to protest against President Trump's policies until impeachment happens. State officials are putting everything on the table. Today a source in the state government told me that that involves finding ways to stop the flow of funds from California to Washington, D.C., reported San Francisco's Pix 5. California could very well become an organized non-payer, said Willie Brown Jr., a former speaker of the state assembly in an interview recorded for Pix 5 Sunday morning news. They could recommend non-compliance with the federal tax code. And if they do so they will force the confrontation, because we give Washington more money than Washington gives us. The state is getting ready for a showdown. This is far from the first time elite liberals from the Golden State have issued threats to the rest of the country. A group of prominent Californian celebrities threatened Trump with a total Hollywood strike until he resigned from office. That didn't work out well for them. Will this latest display of petulance work out any better? But the Californian response to Trump's election doesn't end with strikes and threats of withholding tax payments. On Thursday a proposal for California to secede from the United States and become its own nation was submitted to the Secretary of State's office. The proposed Calixit initiative, pushed by Hollywood celebrities, is asking voters to repeal part of the state constitution that declares California a part of the U.S. The proposal has already gained most of the 600,000 signatures required to schedule a state vote in 2019 that will ask voters, should California become a free, sovereign and independent country? California is the most diverse place in the world and we are saying we want to have more immigration, more minorities, more international connection, and essentially reject the values espoused by the Confederacy, said Marcus Ruiz Evans spokesman for the Yes California Independence Campaign. In our view, the United States of America represents so many things that conflict with Californian values, and our continued statehood means California will continue subsidizing the other states to our own detriment, and to the detriment of our children, the Yes Campaign's website says.